na wenzake na mnaona kama tungekawia siku nyingine mbili tatu <laughs> kikundi kingekuwa kikubwa leo tuwafanikiwa speaker wa bunge ya machakos ame catch up na sisi na waheshimiwa hapa mnamjua mheshimiwa Kitui West mheshimiwa uh, Mashako kutoka kule kwa milima ya, ya Taita Taveta Undanyi na pia tuna mheshimiwa kutoka Makueni ama Susan Kiamba mheshimiwa Nyenze um, and of course our brother here we have also some team from Kitui County led by the majority leader Eh waheshimiwa tuwashukuruni sana kwa uvumilivu wenu na hali ya kujitolea. So this morning we want to talk to you about four subjects. Two or three subjects. Ya kwanza ni report ya NADCO. Eh eh. Alafu ya pili ni juu ya fertilizer fake. <laughs> <laughs> Ya tatu we want to talk about freedom of independent media. Na vile sasa tumeona a deliberate attempt to claw back on media gains and the freedom of expression. Ya ene is on corruption. Yaani imekuwa sasa is a, is a daily thing. And uh, so tulizungumza jana juu ya ripoti ya NADCO na vile kwa maoni yetu njama tayari imeundwa hatujui kama imekamilika lakini hata kama imekamilika tunataka wajue tunajua mtu anajitokeza ameundwa properly aelekee mahakama huko Kiambu asimamishe ripoti ya NADCO na hali ripoti yenyewe ni property ya bunge. Bunge tayari, bunge la Senate na bunge la Wakilishi National Assembly walikuwa wamepitisha wakakubaliana na recommendations za report. Sasa ikasalia tu uh, the enabling legislation haswa juu ya IEBC. Wakati tulikuwa tukiendelea na mazungumzo kule Bomas tulikuwa na habari kwamba kulikuwa msukumo mkubwa msukumo mkubwa kiambiwa msipo jihadhari msipo jikakamua mjue kuna jamaa ameenda kwa mahakama eh nia yao ni kujaribu wakimbize mambo yao iwe ni Kenya kwanza peke yao ambao watakaweunda tume mpya ya IBC hilo halikubaliki na kama wataendelea na hiyo route bila shaka tutajua kwamba wameamua kurig elections hata kabla wenyewe kufanyika and Kenyans are fed up and tired of election rigging Kenyans who come out the Senegalese in the recent past <laughs> pekemea hawa watu wa Kenya kwanza Bomet Kericho wa Kenya tayari wako kwa mitaa so This time itakuwa ni, ni viongozi wenyewe kujiunga na wananchi Lakini kabla hiyo fanyike bado kuna nafasi nafasi ya kuonyesha kwa mara ya kwanza kwanza kuna nia njema ya kujaribu kutekeleza kikamilifu makubaliano ya National Dialogue Committee bila mtu yeyote kujaribu kuleta uhasama huko katikati. So, hiyo ni juu ya NADCO. Wao kidhubutu kuweka makamishi na wao kufanya nini? 